Poor ventilation increases the risk of COVID-19 transmission in the air. Employers can reduce this risk by improving ventilation in their workplaces, along with other safe management measures. Here is what you can do to improve ventilation. For workplaces with air conditioning systems with mechanical ventilation, maximize the fresh air intake. Disable controls that reduce air supply. Open all air dampers and install additional fresh air supply ducts if system does not deliver sufficient outdoor air. Minimize indoor air recirculation and use high efficiency filters. Purge air at least once a day and for at least two hours before people arrive. For workplaces with air conditioning systems without mechanical ventilation or non-air conditioned workspaces, keep windows and doors open as frequently as possible. Install window mounted fans or set up standing fans facing open windows. Keep exhaust fans in toilets and kitchens on at full speed and open the windows and doors before and after each occupancy. Use a carbon dioxide meter to check how ventilated your workspaces are. High carbon dioxide levels indicate poor ventilation in your workplace. In spaces that can get crowded, install sensors that can display carbon dioxide levels constantly. This can alert you to overcrowding and inadequate ventilation. In air-conditioned spaces, carbon dioxide levels should be less than 800 parts per million. If carbon dioxide levels are above the recommended levels, even after you've taken measures to improve ventilation, consider the following. Refrain from mask off activities. Reduce the number of employees physically within the workplace at any one time. Prevent crowding at gathering spots like lift lobbies and pantries by staggering work and break timings. Improve ventilation by opening windows and doors. Use air cleaning technologies. Take time to take care of workers' health and safety.